Today I'm glad to share with you our paper entitled Exploring Event Trace Retrieval Methods in Process Mining. My presentation consists of five sections. At the beginning, the introduction aims at introducing and defining some keywords that will lead us to understand our paper objective related to process mining context. This will also present backgrounds to determine the originality of our paper. Next, we will detail our methodology and review strategy. In the context of our article, the next critical phase is to involve the pivotal task of conducting the assessment, a comprehensive evaluation that is essential to achieving our objective. Last, a conclusion summarizes the paper and our perspectives. So our article outlines a systematic literature review aiming to explore even trace retrieval methods in process mining, addressing the inherent challenges and assessing the potential solutions. Consider the following key points, elucidating this investigation. Then the question follow. What does mean process mining? What is the primary challenge associated with process mining? What fundamental issues are highlighted regarding the dependencies of process mining and even date, data in systems not inherently designed for process analysis? What is the main goal of the systematic literature review described in this paper? How does the investigation aim to assist the applicability or universality of event trace retrieval methods in different contexts? and what potential solutions or advancements in even trace utilization for process mining are expected to emerge from this research. To answer to these questions, let's start by defining process mining as a discipline. Process mining, which has a discipline combined between management, business process and data mining notions, its objective is to discover monitor and improve real processes by extracting knowledge from event logs. An event is the starting point of process mining as shown in this figure. An event log is recorded by software system. A common structure of an event log is illustrated in the following figure. A process consists of cases or complete processes instances. Each case is made of a sequence of events called a trace. An event can uh, have any kind of additional attributes, timestamps, scores, resources, depending on the purposes of uh, any organization. Basically, its techniques are discovery takes an event log and produce a model. Confirm as checking, compare the existing model to event log of the same model and check if it is corresponding to reality as recorded in the event log. And enhancement, an existing process model using information about the actual process recorded in some event log to improve the original process model. So event logs so event logs are crucial for process mining and exploring event logs retrieval methods is important in this context. So passing now to the methodology section that delineates our approach detailed in two pivotal subsections, assessment preparation and process protocol, which collectively form, form the procedural framework for our research and over. The goal is to conduct a structured systematic literature review in software engineering. This includes justifying the review's necessity, framing research question, devising a comprehensive review framework strategy, setting study evaluation criteria, synthesizing data, and creating a project schedule. The aim is to enhance software engineering practices or validate existing ones by reconciling assumption with real world perspective. Okay. After formulating the investigation protocol, we begin the review process, which includes the following activities. Identify relevant research studies, selection of studies meeting the defined criteria, 
assess the quality of the selected studies, retrieve data and monitor progress of review, synthesizers of extracted data. So, we will answer to the following questions. Are real event trace retrieval techniques can be employed by individuals without expertise? Does a universal event trace retrieval method exist for collecting event data from reverse information systems? Are real practical technologies available for adding event trace retrieval? The section conducting the assessment comprises two vital subsections. The first concerns the discovery and completion of core research articles, while the second focuses on data retrieval and synthesis, both integral steps in our comprehensive evaluation process. Mainly, the subsequent provides uh, a brief overview of the main characteristics of the core research article. It's followed by tables showing the data extracted using the designed data retrieval protocol. The review progressed by assessing document title and abstract for relevance, resulting in 80 articles focusing on event trace retrieval for process mining. Subsequently, 41 articles meeting criteria number two offered detailed approach information. Among this, uh, these, 30 satisfied criteria number 5 by presenting practical approaches for real-world application. To pre prevent redundancy, 14 papers were excluded if a author had multiple similar works, leaving a final selection of uh, 16 core research articles for the literature review. Thus, after stringent application of inclusion exclusion criteria 16 articles were included in the survey so the figure shows even to trace retrieval approach categorized by a publication years of core research articles three significant peaks stands out in the count of documented methodologies in 2012 shortly after the PM Manifesto release in 2017 and in 2023. The figure also shows source categories of core research articles, 53% from scientific journal, 27% from conferences and master thesis. This figure reveals that only 20% of the reviewed with methodologies are suitable for application by a layperson, whereas the remaining of 80% uh, of the method necessitate prof proficiency in programming. So this is a, the, the answer to the question, are there even trace retrieval techniques that can be employed by individuals without expertise? Figures answer to the questions, does a generic event trace retrieval approach exists that can be employed for retrieving data from any category of information system. This shows the retrieved data that addresses uh, this second research query. During data retrieval, event trace retrieval methodologies were observed and categorized based on diverse information system categories. The most frequently used methodologies focused on objects and data. Notably, methods show with versatility applicability to any data source or information system category. For more two approaches, targeted could systems, uh, one addressed non-process over information system, and finally proposed retrieval from information system supporting and structured business processes. This figure provides information about the technologies and the plugins created to mechanize even trace retrieval methodologies arranged in ascending order based on their year of development. The table also includes details about the even trace formats generated as a result of the even trace retrieval process. The third research qu query are there any viable technology that facilitates even trace retrieval indicate the feasibility of these technologies. Consequently, even though each technology and method come with specific constraints, 
they are regraded as suitable for real world implementation. So our study extensively reviewed literature's fixation on even trace retrieval methods in process minor critical phase. We explored the availability of retrieval methods for our experts, uh, the existence of generic approaches across information system categories, and available facilitating technologies. Now, future works uh, can be focused on the quality of uh, retrieved event logs. We can uh, define some metrics to have new quality of event logs. And thank you for your attention.